Hey, it's good to see you guys again. My name, as you know at this point, is Mr. Mayungo. Excellent job. I heard some of you guys saying it. Keep up the good work. Um, and today we're going to be diving into our last, last day of our first track. You guys have been doing everything really, really well. Keep up the great work. Today, we're going to be looking at something slightly different. But it still plays a big part into everything that we're doing when we're creating our All About books. Let's take a look at an example really quickly. What is this? I hear some of you saying it. Yeah, it, glossary. Can you say glossary? Glossary. Excellent job. Glossary is a list of words and their definition. Glossary is a list of words and their definitions. What is a glossary, guys? Excellent. Today, we're going to be creating our own glossary because all of our authors always have a glossary to help them better understand more about their specific topic. So your words that will go into your glossary needs to match your topic or needs to be suited with your topic. Give me a thumbs up if that makes sense. Excellent job. So, good authors use a glossary in order to highlight the technical vocabulary that's matched to the what? Thought I heard it. Close. The topic are all about topic, okay? So, today, let's take a look at what we've already had to see if we have any words that will, could fit into our glossary. As you can see, any word that is underlined is a special word. They all go into our glossary. So we have nutrients, we have rates, we have consume, and we have bland. Tonight for homework, your job is to dive back into your all about books and pick out a few technical vocabulary that will go into your glossary that is linked to your topic, that goes exactly with your topic. Then, you're not done, don't just identify them. What else do we have to add to it? Yes, we need to add the definitions and the page that each word was found. What are the two things we're going to be adding to our glossary besides just the vocabulary words? The definitions and the page number. So once we record the vocabulary words that matches our topic, we need the definitions and excellent job. Can't wait to see what you come up with for our last day for our first draft. Keep up the good work. 